So today I'm going to show you how to configure a Windows 10 computer with two network cards to run the Paxton software using Net2 Access Control on a completely isolated network from the normal network. We're going to disable IPv6 and rename the network cards so you know exactly what's going on. So this is an example of the computer in question. We're going to rename the onboard NIC here. And we're going to rename the additional NIC we've put in, uh, Paxton LAN. So I've got the Paxton LAN connected to a switch already. So if we go down, right click and open network and internet settings. Click on Ethernet and change adapter options. Like I said, the NIC I have here which is the Paxton LAN, the additional card. This is the one we're working on first. So we're going to rename it. And we're going to call it Paxton LAN. OK. We're now going to disable IPv6. So right click, properties. Scroll down to IPv6 take the check away and click OK. We're going to do the same with the onboard NIC. So the onboard NIC being this one here. So we're going to right click, rename, just so we know exactly what's what. With this one, we're going to right click, properties from the drop down menu. And again, we're going to disable IPv6. We're not going to change any other settings, so that's fine. So now we need to set the default IP for the Paxton LAN. So we'll start from scratch. We'll right click, open network and internet settings, click on Ethernet change adapter options. Now we know which is which. So right click on Paxton LAN, properties, select IPv4 and properties again. Now for the purpose of this dem demo, I've been asked to include these IPs. So your IP address for this server computer running win Windows 10 is 10.44.22.0. 12 with a 16 bit subnet mask, so 255.255.0.0. Now we don't set no default gateway and no DNS servers. Click OK and click close. Now, when you install the Paxton software, you're going to point it at this network card and it's going to pick up any IP nodes, controllers, things like this. When the company you're using this computer in, connect to their production network, this is the network card they'll connect to. So they're connecting to the onboard NIC, which will get an automatic IP address, subnet mask, gateway, DNS, or they might decide they're going to put fixed in. In that case, they'll go in and put the settings in themselves. Ours have been set here. This is the one we named Pac Paxton LAN, and we gave this the IP config of Ten dot four dot twenty two dot twelve with a subnet mask of two five five two five five dot zero dot zero. Do not put a gateway in. If you do, things will start going wrong. Okay, so that's it. I hope you liked the vid. Don't forget to uh, subscribe and thanks very much for watching.